What's up you guys? It's Monday. No, it's not. It's Tuesday and I'm doing a work week in my life vlog. So I just got back from work and it's only four o'clock because today was like a weird work day. I didn't vlog yesterday. I had like meetings back to back to back. And so I just didn't have much time at my desk. Not that I filmed myself at work, but it was just a really busy day. But today was not like technically like a normal work day. We didn't go to the office. We had like a brand wide town hall. A lot of companies do that. I'm gonna try and like be productive until six like I normally would. But kind of like a different schedule. So I wanna film a haul video because it's really rainy out. So it's pretty gray. So we'll see if the lighting's okay enough to film the haul. Really feeling kind of gross right now. I don't know, I'm like having brain fog right now. It's not, I don't feel good. I guess I'm gonna light a couple of candles, um, put up my like work bag. I do this cleaning routine probably like every other night. I just come back and bleach life and turn on the robot vacuum. Hey guys, so I just filmed my haul video. I am going to do some work for actual work and then edit my video and post that tonight. But I have a bunch of recycling that I need to put up, so I'm going to go downstairs and um, empty all this trash and recycling. I have like the whole night ahead of me. It feels so good because normally I get off at like 6 or 6.30 and then by the time I get home it's like 7, 7.30 and so I'm gonna just like take the night to be productive because I really didn't get any work done today um, since we were at that town hall. And I'm gonna be productive, so it's gonna be good. I had currently have this lodged on my Molten Brown lotion knob and I'm not sure if this is gonna tip over, but it's gonna have to work. It's like 10.50 now. Last time I talked to you, I'm pretty sure I was emptying out my recycling, so crazy content afterwards i drank a cup of coffee i'm still feeling quite alert and i took a shower up edited and uploaded my video and then i posted an instagram and an instagram story and yeah it feels so good when i post a video did you guys watch my work week in my life last week um do you remember the shortbread cookies because i don't have them i ran out I'm just enjoying this tea and it's not quite satisfying i'm gonna check my youtube comments before i go to bed 11 o'clock i'm gonna go brush my teeth and then go to bed good night bye what's up you guys tuesday morning no wednesday morning um wow it's already halfway through the week so i actually planned out my outfits for the week and i'm gonna switch to this today and then my other outfit tomorrow this outfit's cuter so i'm gonna wear it today because we have a bunch of meetings What's up you guys? So I just got out of work and I'm heading to the grocery store actually. Busy day, I got out at 6.30, it's like 7.10. Two minutes later. Hey guys, the last time we talked was when I was on my way home from work going to the grocery store. So I got back like 20 minutes ago and so today was a great day at work. So that's good. Tomorrow's already Thursday which is Awesome, the week is kind of flying by. I mean, like, set plans for the weekend now, but trying to figure out what I'm gonna do. Next month and a half are really crazy, so next week I'm doing the housewarming, and then one of my friends is actually coming to New York to visit. And then two weeks after that, one of my college roommates and all of our like best friends from school are having a bachelorette weekend for my friend Alexandra. I'm in her wedding, we're all in her wedding. There might be a week in between, I think my friend is visiting for Labor Day. And then the weekend after that is her wedding. I'm up some water and I'm gonna make my dinner. I'm just gonna make like a healthy lo mein. By healthy, like can lo mein even be healthy? What's up you guys? I haven't talked to you since yesterday after we work at yesterday night. I'm gonna turn off the AC. This morning I went to a yoga class. I went to, it was like a very slow flow. It's like a nice, good, relaxing start to your morning, I guess. But I had already like traveled 25 minutes there and I was pretty like alert and awake. So I kind of wanted something a little bit more energizing and less like chill. Um, but it was really nice. It was in this beautiful studio. And then the actual room was like dark and there was like this low humming noise the entire time, which was very, relaxing it's eight o'clock i'm going to film my outfit clip for my outfit of the week video and then i'm going to take a shower took off my makeup 
and just chill. What's up you guys, it's Saturday and I did vlog yesterday, but I, I'm gonna kind of walk you through it. So I went to Soho after work, which I really need to stop going shopping on summer Fridays, but I get off at one and I'm like, hmm, what should I do to like pass the time? Cause a lot of my friends don't have summer Fridays. Just end up going shopping all the time. And I went to a sample sale. It was the same sample sale I mentioned in my last haul video. What's up you guys? So I just went to a little boutique and now I'm heading off to sample sale and I will try and film as much as I can. Just went to this little boutique and they had the cutest stuff but I went into the dressing room and there was like, like not a mirror in there. Okay, so down in Soho I'm now on like Prince Street and I'm going to go to like the main street and go bring you with me while I go to like Zara and Bloomingdale's all of like the bigger stores but for now there's like these smaller stores. I'm gonna first go to the sample sale. We'll talk to you guys then. It wasn't the same sample sale, it was the same location. It's called 260 Sample Sale. I'm not sponsored. I went to Zara and I found some really cute stuff, but I always go to Zara to like see what micro trends are like coming up. And then I scored at Aritzia. That's the only place I actually ended up buying stuff. Best best summer sale selection. Um, so I got two things, but I tried on probably 30 things. They had such good stuff. There's no mirrors in the dress room it's just two big mirrors with all of the people so i didn't really want to vlog other people trying stuff on i'll show it to you guys in an upcoming haul video oh that's such good stuff i went to and other stories and i instagram storied this immaculate dress it's like this beautiful printed halter neck open back dress so stunning silky material i have literally nowhere i could wear it to because it's open back i can't wear it to work and it would look horrible with like a jacket over top um this morning i've been filming it's like now noon and that's why i'm in my pjs because i'm filming like a morning routine video i go back to filming and i will talk to you guys in a little hey guys it's like five o'clock now and i finished filming my outfit video not outfit well yes it was an outfit video it's like style video i am trying to figure out what all i need to do today versus tomorrow so i think i'm gonna make in my agenda just a to-do list show you guys my grocery haul i wasn't originally gonna get stuff from whole foods because then i have to get over 35 dollars but i just bought a candle to make it over so got an avocado i'm making this cauliflower salad this week um tomatoes which i'm going to use for uh, my pesto pasta this week i got bananas i got chickpeas for that cauliflower salad mustard for the cauliflower salad dressing another one of my favorite candles it's the one i'm currently using it's tico de tobacco i get these from urban outfitters the milk which is non it doesn't have lactose in it but i mean here i am with coffee creamer so i haven't tried this before but it's the french vanilla one from organic valley got a whole cauliflower what's up you guys so it's sunday and i'm waiting to cross the street now i am it's probably not safe so i'm heading to brunch with another vlogger vlogger gal like so have a west village area i'm gonna probably stop vlogging but i will show you guys the food later hi guys so i just got done with brunch i met up with this um, girl named Gabby, I'll have her links down below. She's so nice. So I'm heading to Target. I have like a little Target gift card, so I might go to buy some stuff for this house hoarding party I'm having next week. Hopefully, they have something to make my apartment look a little cuter. One of my friends is actually staying at my apartment this week, so I need to head back before then so that I'll be there when she's there. So I will talk to you guys when I get to Target. All right, you guys, I'm gonna show you my outfit. Um, so my hair is just in second day waves. It's really loose now. So this top and this hat are new. Um, this is from Zara. This is from A Piece Apart. I got it at the sample sale and I love it. I'm obsessed with it. And I'll link it on the haul that I showed these two new items in. And then I just have on my denim shorts and I really need to get like new ones because these are like ripped apart completely. But they're the most comfortable shorts ever. I DIY made them. Um, by just cropping a pair of jeans and then I have on my Stuart Weitzman espadrilles. They're like these 
ankle strap espadrilles. I got them last year, but if I can find them, I will put them down below. And then I just carried around my New Yorker tote because I brought my laptop with me and knew I was going grocery shopping. So I like to bring a tote so that I can like carry it on my shoulder and not in like a plastic bag. So I was walking to Target. I saw in Trader Joe's window an orchid. And I've been dying to get an orchid so badly. I made quite a scene at Trader Joe's because this specific one, they had a bunch with the like purple inside. And I don't personally like those as much as these. Uh, but this one had a broken pot, so I made one of the Trader Joe's guys switch it out for me. So, I don't know where I'm going to put it, but she's so pretty. Also, I'll do a little Target haul. I got some dish towels. Like I use so many paper towels, which is just like super wasteful. But we only have this little dish towel. So, I got more. pack of like five. And since our whole apartment's like really just like gray and white, I figure this would look pretty cute. It's great hand towel which is so soft and like such a pretty color it like matches our walls exactly that looks good also yesterday i spent almost an hour soaking off my dip nail polish and i got it all off and i'm going to stop going to get my nails done because it's very expensive it's like an 110 dollar a month habit bought this supposedly long lasting Essie gel like pink and I'm gonna try that on my nails today. So I just cleaned up my apartment a little. Um, I put the new dish towels, which I think look pretty good. And then I just emptied the dishwasher and cleaned. I just Swiffer the floors, have my robot vacuum going. I am literally the clean police. I'm trying to figure out where my new orchid child is going to live. I don't know. I don't know about the Jo Malone candle, where to put it. I used to have this sitting next to that. Or I'm potentially thinking I could either do it. It doesn't want direct sunlight, so I'm not sure if it's great to put it in the windowsill or maybe even there. I think that looks way too cluttered. Too big for any other place. So I think she is going here. Okay, you guys. So I'm going to sign off. I know this... I have a question actually for you guys because I've been filming my weekends just because my weeks are like not super entertaining but would you guys rather me focus more on like the nitty gritty of my work week or would you rather do like a full week in my life? So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching and please leave comments with content that you guys want to see. What videos you want to see, what you want to see more of on Instagram stories and on my um, grid. Let me know. Love to hear it. So I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.